<laughs> heading out of here off the job site. I think I showed it. Yeah, I did. Gotta go easier. It's really rough right here. Really bumpy. You can hear my frame tweaking. Down a steep hill into the town of Fishers. There's a New York State Thruway. At, well, that's Route 490, Rochester. To Rochester. That's a Thruway entrance way, though. It's a pretty steep grade here. It's hard to see there from here, but you can see down in the hills down below. Little town of Fishers. Now with load number four or five, I can't really remember. A little bit of DOT road work there. Let's try the Jake out. You hear it? A little Jake brake action today. <laughs> I normally don't use that much anymore. Okay. So the Denny's here. Chili's over here. Out in the little town I ate at Wendy's over there for lunch. Taco Bell's over there I ate there for breakfast. Don't get out this way too much, so. Haven't seen them restaurants for a while this year, so. Life Storage, that's a new facility. Used to be Tamby there, I think. That's where my, where's this where Tamby was? No, where my son used to work in there and his mom. All right, heading over here past a lot of, uh, there's three brokers out here in this little town, right on this road, it's crazy. Ah, oh boy, can I make this one? Yes, I can. It's gotta go easy. It's a bad corner here too. It's a little tippy off to the passenger side. So um, shift down a gear too. And uh, 200, 100, 200, 116 miles. Um, oh, I gotta plug my GPS's in. Still cooking lunch that I didn't eat. Um, Three contracts, I don't know if I should name them on here anyway, but here's some factories out here. That's a big building there they put up recently. It's called the Athletic Campus. I don't know what that is, but that's an old building. It's been around for a long, long time here. Some old storage trailers here and stuff. There's a broker there. Or not a broker, but a, a a um, contractor it uses brokers another uh, contractor there big ones too these guys are and then uh, there's another one up here around the corner there's a truck hanging out there some couple old cars there worked on all this road here before this is like a call them a highway but it's yeah we did all this corner and this whole road put it all this in the bridge the whole road is completely out one here couldn't even get through did all this put that little thing there trail all this bridge doesn't look like a bridge now but that's a bridge there right a bunch of cattails in there and uh Four minutes, but yeah, I'm heading to Menden to dump this load of rubble. Little kitty dealer there. Um, worked up in here at LSI, and uh, another broker in here. The one I'm working for out in the boonies there in Miscan. This is, I believe, is their home shop. It's going to be now a massive building, unless it's just one of their projects. I can't. I it might be one of their. I've worked there at the very beginning, I think it was that one. And there's the 
contractor, but I'm not sure if that's going to be their shop. I don't know. I guess I don't know. It's going to just be their signage. The, the general contractor usually puts up a big sign, you know, and the subcontractors are underneath on the sign. This is a big old, uh, this used to be a big uh, snowmobile parts distributor company right here. O'Neill Associates, back if you were a dealer. My father was a dealer. Um, and uh, it still says O'Neill on there. Or up here, O'Neill Associates. I went in there and actually bought parts for snowmobiles. They used to be in way before the day of the internet. Oh my goodness, in the 70s and 80s. And, uh, you know, that was a, you know, it was Parts Unlimited was a big snowmobile catalog and, and, and O'Neill Associates had a catalog too and my father would get snowmobile parts from those guys plus from the dealers but aftermarket parts those were the big aftermarket companies it seemed like in the day there's a couple other ones that have magazines now too they still do I can't remember what they are uh, uh, Kirk that is Kirk for that one if you're into snowmobiles and stuff and motorcycles and they're old school so the they used to do it right so yeah, a lot of factory, little factories and businesses, you know, and then you get into the town of Monroe County and town of Mendon, and this is quite so businessy here, I guess. Out in the boonies, though, kind of here, too. A little bit of fall foliage going on. Old Cub Cadet, Boda dealer. Did all this road, too, all through here. Did this shoulder all here they cut all this edge in here when these houses are back in there worked on all that edging there or all that little berm yep this was a lot of road here okay it's about at seven minutes all right that's it it's friday i'm out of here